hello guys welcome to my channel in this tutorial we'll see how to calculate the moisture index using landsat image satellite and arcgis pro as we know it is difficult to uh, determine which area is more which area has more uh, moisture level from the rgb or color infrared ones but we need to apply some band differencing or rationing to uh, analyze the moisture content in different area for this i am going to use a landsat 8 image so first we need to determine which bands are more suitable to calculate the moisture content or moisture index so uh, so moisture index is a more sophisticated use of spectral bands and that is an index which is a calculation that computes a ratio between different bands and in this case the moisture index the bands involves uh, near infrared band or band 5 in the case of a band land start 8 and the short infrared one or band 6 and the formula is band 5 minus band 6 over band 5 plus band 6 so first we need to add the two bands which is uh, band 5 and the band 6 in the case of Landsat 8 Here I have added the band 5 and the band 6 of Landsat 8 So uh, Go to the analyst tool and find for search for this uh, map algebra in the raster calculator and then we need to write some syntax to uh, difference in the ratio of these two bands. So the formula is uh, band 5 minus band 6 over band 5 plus band 6. So first we need to use the float. Double click on it and then the this bracket write first band 5 minus minus okay. band 6 then over again use flows band 5 plus Band 5 plus band 6. Yeah, check uh, whether you have written a correct syntax and finally give the output location and the output file name and run the process. Yeah, the process is completed. So this is the output uh, moisture index, which has a lowest value of zero negative zero point five and the highest value of zero point four, uh, based on the total amount of uh, data from the input image. So we can change the color ramp to render this image and make it more uh, clear. <coughs> So uh, from this color lamp, you can see that the negative value shows that uh, an area with very, a very low moisture level and the positive value shows that an area with uh, a very high uh, moisture level. So if it's a near infrared band, in this case band 5 is uh, higher than the short to infrared short infrared one or band six 
the value of the result will be positive or higher and uh, this it, it, it denotes that a higher moisture level but uh, it, if it is uh, less than or if the value of uh, near infrared or band 5 is less than the short to infrared one the negative the value will be negative and that denotes that the area has a low level of moisture uh, content so from this you can you can check we can see that this area has highest value of the moisture uh, index or it is around 0 0.4 this green area this <coughs> green area so uh, it, it shows that this area has more moisture content again in this case which is a negative value of moisture index you can identify each pixel for example this, this pixel has a moisture index of negative 0.09 which shows uh, a very low moisture level so from this uh, index or from the output of this uh, index we can uh, monitor the drought or we can use this image to monitor the drought around this area again we can uh, use this for measuring the desertification and we can do more uh, detail analysis about the uh, area by using this moisture uh, index so uh, this is all about today's tutorial and don't forget to subscribe, like and share my channel and thank you.